Meiosis is a form of cell division, whereby one diploid nucleus goes through two divisions in order to form four haploid nuclei. In each division, meiosis 1 and meiosis 2, there are four stages, prophase, metaphase, anaphase and telophase. Recalling that DNA is replicated during the S phase of interphase prior to meiosis, during prophase 1, the homologous chromosomes pair up, whereby each chromosome exists with two sister chromatids. Crossing over and chiasmata formation can occur between non-sister chromatids. This can result in exchange of DNA which contributes to genetic variation in the gametes. And as prophase 1 progresses, the DNA condenses to become visible and the nuclear membrane disintegrates. During metaphase 1, the homologous pairs align along the equator, with each chromosome in the homologous pair existing with sister chromatids. Orientation of the maternal and paternal chromosomes in the homologous pair, represented here by blue and green, is random along the equator, and this contributes to genetic variation in the gametes. Next is anaphase 1, where the homologous pairs are separated. The spindle fibres attach to the centromere and pull each chromosome in the homologous pairs to opposite poles. The nuclear membrane reforms during telophase 1, and this is followed by cytokinesis, where the cytoplasm splits to form two cells. Meiosis II then begins with prophase II, where the nuclear membrane breaks down. The chromosomes, each existing with two sister chromatids, then align along the equator during metaphase II. This is followed by anaphase II, where the sister chromatids are separated by spindle fibres. Once separated, they can be called chromosomes. During telophase 2, the nuclear membrane reforms, and this is again followed by cytokinesis, where the cytoplasm is split. The final product of meiosis is four haploid cells, each of which is genetically different from each other.